Excuse me, little dog. <coughs> It is a spectacularly gorgeous night. An over the top beautiful moonlit night here in the end times. Where are we, little dog? Are we at Thursday night, September 19th, 20? 22, 2022, whatever the fuck year it is. And so what you guys are experiencing right now is something you have never seen before. Something Sancho Panza has never seen before. Something that None of all of my beautiful, little, clueless, moron, lovable friends in Austin, Texas have never seen before. This is history being made on Humpty Dumpty Tribe. It is three nights before my 65th birthday when I officially become a decrepit old fart and uh, this is the first time it was well what is it is fucking Thursday night we are three nights short. It was 20... What is 65 minus 37? Is that 28? It has been 28 years since I have been fucking drunk. You have never seen in Humpty Dumpty Tribe history but I fucking look like when I'm fucking drunk, and it's not a pretty fucking sight. I think there's this, uh, there's this fucking little, uh, little myth going around that Hambone Little Tail is, is, is some sort of fucking drunk. What do you think? You like the taste of that margarita on my hand or what? He said, Bob, I kind of like the taste of that margarita. This is the first time, guys, in 28 years that I have had more than two drinks. In a 24-hour period. And, uh, well, you can't hold your fucking liquor. What did you have? Did you have three? Did you have? <laughs> what did you have? You had three drops, three drops of margarita, and you're already and you're already coughing. I make a pretty strong fucking drink, don't I, dog? <laughs> it's my, my little alcoholic dog. He's had three dr three drops uh, uh, of one of my fucking drinks. Yes, little dog. Are you gonna Are you gonna survive three fucking drops? Oh fuck! Twenty eight years it has been since I have felt like this. 
28 fucking years. I reach up to take my glasses off and I notice my, I'm not wearing my glasses. Yes, little dog, are you going to survive? <laughs> Sancho Pons is not a is not a hardcore drinker, I can tell. I don't think you need to drink another drop uh, <laughs> of that drink. I've, so, uh, I've told this story before, and I was probably going to bring it up on Sunday night when I, when I go back through my broken record uh, you know, Sunday when, when I finally officially become a, a decrepit old fart. I have two more days of being a middle-aged man. A middle-aged man. I have two more fucking days to claim that I am middle-aged, uh, which I guess officially I was 35. So, uh, 35 years old, when I was a, a fucking roaring fucking drunk. If, if people haven't figured this out about me, w with all of the, uh, the ham bone mistake, mistake, yes, the ham bone mistake, the ham bone mystique, I was a fucking drunk, okay? for years, and so uh, I guess two years into middle age on my 37th birthday, you know, when my, when I had just learned that my mother had stage four uh, ovarian cancer, and I was up uh, sitting alone uh, by myself with my thumb up my fucking ass, uh, on my 37th birthday at this little cabin out in the woods in the middle of fucking nowhere. Uh, on my 37th birthday, uh, 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 imagine that. And, uh, and so that was the night I was going to fucking kill myself. I had it all laid out. I had the fucking... Uh, you, you know, I... I I had, what was it, like 80 Darvon uh, laid out. I had already written the suicide note. And uh, so I, I was sitting there going through this, uh, working my way down to this bottle. It was, I, I think it was actually vodka. This was in the... Uh, Cleveland, Georgia, on September 22nd, 1997. And so, I had already written my suicide note out, <laughs> and I, I, I had all the fucking Darvon laid out, and, and so I was supposed to take myself out, uh that night and like, like one hour before uh, I, I, I'm ready to fucking kill myself, uh, the, the goddamn phone rings up there and it's my sister. Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! And uh... <laughs> Oh, God, that was a dark night of the soul, so, uh, I am, uh, if I could have made it three more nights, I would have made it 28 years without, uh, without being drunk, so, you know, I, uh, I went cold turkey that night, and, and, and I went six fucking years, six years w without a fucking drink.
six years. Can you hear the owl out there? And, uh, so as I'm told, I'm not going to retell the story about, uh, how I started drinking again in Austin, Texas. In, uh, Well, maybe I didn't make it six years. Maybe it was four years. Anyway, four years. Anyway, I think it was 2002. Yeah, it was, it was 2002 in Austin, Texas, when I started drinking again. And so for the past 22 years, 22 years of my life, I have had pretty much two drinks every night, 365 nights a year for 22 fucking years, never been drunk. Okay, when I, you know, when I reinvented myself uh, for those years in Austin, Texas, going out to all of those goddamn picking parties and and hanging and running around to all the fucking bars and all of this shit. Uh, as hard as I, I think my all of my fucking drunk ass friends in Austin, Texas, and I, I never got drunk. There is not one fucking person in the city of Austin, Texas who has ever seen me fucking drunk before. There is not one person I have ever met in the Doomosphere that has ever seen me drunk. Sandy has never seen me drunk. Sandy Shellis has never seen me drunk. None of you have. Sancho Panza. Sancho Panza has never seen me drunk. You know what's more? You know what's more? Not it's like you like that when it was on my hand like that. So this dog ha has never known what the fuck I look like when I'm fucking drunk. Yes. What do you think? It's a Bob. I'm not sure that I like the new Bob like that. I hate my fucking life. I fucking hate my life. This dog right here is the only fucking thing I have in my life right now. You're the one thing I have in my fucking life. This, this is the one joy that I have in my fucking life. Two more days of middle-aged, then I am officially a bitter, angry, lonely old man with broken fucking teeth, stranded without love. In the middle of fucking nowhere.
And this is what I have to fucking show for it. 65 years. 65 fucking years. Hold on. I don't know if I like the new pop or not. I don't know if I like the drunken, uh, the drunken pop. This is uh, I'm not liking this. <laughs> oh God. Yes, little dog. Lucky you. You're the one who got stuck with me. My soulmate. This is my soulmate. And this little dog dies. It's going to be the darkest fucking day of my whole fucking life. So I get to figure out what the fuck I'm, what the fuck am I doing with the rest of my fucking worthless, pointless fucking life. I've spent the whole what I've done this whole fucking day, guys, is I I have spent this whole day trying to get people to cancel their reservations at Bugs in a Jar Farm. After that fucking little cunt last night. That fucking little cunt last night, she fucking triggered something. Five fucking years of my life. Five fucking years of my life I, I, I have put in to uh, to putting this little vision together out here at Bugs in a Jar Farm. And that snotty little fucking cunt coming up to me and, and, and bitching about the fucking dust on her fucking little, little fucking knife holder. I don't know how I didn't knock that fucking cunt uh, across the fucking... Uh, 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 I, I was this fucking close to knocking that fucking bitch off this fucking porch. I've never hit a fucking woman in my life. Fucking cunt coming up to me. I can't stay here. I just don't feel safe. There's dust on the knife holder. I like to take that fucking knife and slam it down your fucking throat, you fucking bitch. I don't want any more fucking clueless morons setting foot on this fucking property. I got rid of three of the motherfuckers. Damn woman with her single mother, with her five-year-old. He's so excited about coming to you. Shut the fuck up, bitch. I don't want your fucking little five-year-old, little fucking planet-nibbling bundle of joy setting foot on my fucking property. I got rid of that fucking cunt. Uh, and, 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 then, uh, and then I had this one. Uh, she, she was bringing her fucking dogs. 
And, and, I, and I said, listen, darling, you need to send me a picture or, or, or those fucking dogs. I said, you know, I don't allow fucking pit bulls on this property. I, 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 I said, you need to send me a fucking picture of those fucking dogs but before you show your ass up here Saturday night. She sends me the picture and it's a fucking pit bull. Told her to take her fucking pit bull and cram it up her fucking ass. Say, get your fucking pit bull off of my fucking property. Get your fucking five year old punk ass little fucking spawn off of my fucking property. Got rid of one more. Who else did I get rid of? Oh, about the heater. And I said, listen, you clueless motherfucker. It's getting cold up here. If you show up here and it's fucking cold, well, no shit, Sherlock. So I got rid of three of the motherfuckers. So sick and tired of fucking people. I, 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 you know, uh, I mean, I understand exactly what my mother was fucking talking about. Uh, when she, you know, starting about my age now, I've met every fucking human, I, every fucking person I ever want to meet as long as I fucking live. My mother spent the last 10 years of her fucking life uh, hiding out. Uh, she would go back and forth. She would spend uh, 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 most of the week uh, lying in bed, drinking her goddamn, uh, her, her goddamn, uh, what, what does she drink? Ancient age bourbon and Coke. She would sit there drinking ancient age bourbon and coke and watching CNN. This was back before the fucking internet. We're trying to figure out how fucked we are. Um, you know, watching her son die of AIDS. And then she would go up uh, to our little cabin. Uh, up there in the woods in North Georgia, you know, where it was, where I just, where I came within this fucking close uh, of taking myself out uh, 28 fucking years ago. Uh, and, 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 and she would go up there uh, to her land up in North Georgia and uh, ride around on her little, her little John Deere uh, lawnmower, looking like me on my fucking little John Deere gator. Riding around, around and around and around uh, on her fucking little lawnmower and then uh, going in and pouring her fucking uh, bourbon and coke. And, and drinking herself into fucking oblivion and, and, and until finally she got fucking cancer and died at age 76. 76. That's when my mother died. 11 fucking years. 11 fucking years. Uh, uh, m m more of this fucking sentence. The very thought, the very fucking thought uh, uh, of being on this fucking planet uh, for 11 fucking more years dealing with fucking humans. I despise fucking humans. I love a few people, but I despise fucking humans.
I'll take this fucking little dog uh, over every uh, uh, over eight billion humans any day. When 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 this little dog. Uh, when this little dog goes, put a fucking bullet through my head. So your old super host shutting down. Uh, so here I am shutting down. Uh, f fucking bugs in a jar farm again, uh, going down to to move into uh, uh, this. What is it now? A forty-four year old single wide trailer at the end of a fucking dirt road in, in a fucking swamp in, in Florida for six fucking. What the fuck am I gonna do down there for six fucking months? What the fuck am I gonna do with myself? Six fucking months. What about being a mousy? Is that a mousy? Is that a mousy? Dealing with these fucking rodents, fucking mice, these fucking rats. Every one of these fucking tiny houses sitting here trying to get some fucking sleep. Fucking rodents just gnawing. There's about what is that? The mousy right there. You gonna get the mousy or not? That mousy. Can you hear the fucking rodents gnawing? That's my fucking life, is the sound of fucking gnawing. Just... This is what I get to fucking hear every night, guys. It's, 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 it are these fucking rodents uh, just, just chewing. To, to get in here, to, to, just making a fucking mockery. Every one of these fucking tiny ass. I mean, so uh, I, I mentioned earlier that, uh, so in both of I guess all three tiny houses, now that I kick that fucking cunt and, and her little five-year-old spawn of Satan out of here this weekend, uh, so I'm going to be sitting here, all right, so let's see, in, in, in Seahorse, there's going to be uh, the, the, this woman having her birthday uh, with, with, with her husband in Blue Dragon, I have this, this, this other woman celebrating her birthday with her man. Uh, all of these little, these little love birds. Uh, uh,